Hi friends, and welcome to Tiny Technical Tutorials, where we do bite-sized lessons for today's tech. In this video, I'm going to show you how to convert a PDF to a Word document, something that you can then edit. I'll show you how to work with two different kinds of PDF documents. The first is what I'm calling a native PDF, sometimes referred to as a true PDF. And this is basically a PDF that was created from an electronic document and then saved as a PDF. Specifically, I took this Word document here, the original, let me just open that up, and then I did a save as, and rather than saving it as a Word document, I saved it as a PDF. So that's how I got that native PDF. Started as a Word document, made it into a PDF. The second PDF we'll be working with is the scanned PDF. This one, I took the Word document, printed it out, wrote on it, and then I scanned it in on my scanner. We're going to convert both of these the same way, but you'll see there's some differences in the end result. So let's start with the native PDF here and how to convert that. All you need to do is in Word here, go ahead and open, and then I'll browse for that document. This again is the native PDF. Open, you get a message here that is going to convert your PDF to an editable Word document. That's exactly what we want. Depending on the size of the document, it might take a little minute. Okay, so here I have the PDF that's been converted into a Word document. I'm going to put this side by side with the original one. So we have the original on the right and the converted version over on the left. And you'll see there's some small differences between the two. For example, the indentation here is different on the converted version on the left side. You'll see we've got a small typo here on the two month it was trying to Take that wrapped hyphenated word. So there's going to be just a few small differences, some cleanup that you need to do most likely. And this will depend on the type of document, what kind of formatting is in there, if there's anything sort of unusual that you're trying to pull in. But generally it does a pretty good job taking that native or true PDF and converting it into an editable Word document. Now let's work with a scanned PDF. Let me just open that up and show you what it looks like. So to create this one, I took the original Word document, printed out just the first page to try to conserve paper, and I wrote on it, and then I scanned it back in using my scanner. So this is what we have. Now let's open this one in Word and have it converted over. I'm going to go through the same steps here that we did last time. So open, I'll browse, and we want to get the scanned version. We'll get the same message here, and there you go. You can tell already that's different than what we saw before. So once again on the right, I have the original Word document. And over on the left, this is the converted PDF that's now in Word. And you can see that you can edit it, obviously. But quite a bit of a difference here, just in terms of the formatting and so forth. You'll see that the handwriting got pulled in as an image. That's fine. But just in general, you can see there's going to be a lot more cleanup here, different formatting that you need to take care of and so forth. But you can type whatever you want. So it's editable, which is what we wanted, but you are going to need to come through here and do quite a bit of cleanup work, like I said, to get it to look like the original one. And when you think about it, it's because Word is basically treating the scanned version as a picture, so it doesn't have all of that information that the original document had. It's just coming in as a picture, not as a document. It's trying its best, but it's going to need a little bit of help when you're doing a scanned image. And there you have it. That's how to convert a PDF into an editable Word document. If you found the content valuable, we always appreciate the likes, subscribes, and shares.